everyone welcome back to my channel it's time to review my beauty empties for March and April but before we dive right into it don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and also follow me on Instagram where I'm reviewing frequently skincare related products and to be honest I'm quite a lot more active in there the first product is going to be a cleanser this is Biologique Recharge light O milky cleanser I was so skeptical about this product because it's its consistency is literally milky and as you already know I'm more into foaming cleansers not jelly cleansers but foaming cleanser for sure where when I wash my face I really like the feeling of that clean skin that you have afterwards and I wasn't really sure whether I'm going to like this one or not but I decided to give it a try as you guys already know I switched to Biologie Crocharge facial products and everyone was telling me that I must buy this one and start using and quit the foaming cleansers. So this light version is more suitable for oily skin and probably sensitive skin. It is hydrating but not as much as the other Biology Crochet's Milky Cleansers and it, it is really soft when you spread it all over your face and neck you can actually massage it into your skin. If you have time for some pampering routine you can give yourself a proper massage with their famous motions like upwards going always upwards with the neck face and then forehead in this way you improve blood circulation and it's believed that that helps acne prone skins to heal faster because the products penetrate deeper into the skin and and plus who doesn't love a facial massage especially at night before you go to bed so it's really gentle a really hydrating but not too much you still get a little film on top of your face you kind of think that it didn't cleanse your face properly but the proof test is tap your face with a white towel and see that there will be no makeup left on it. Of course, if you wear a makeup, you need to remove it first by using micellar water or just a cleansing balm. And again, this product is not a cleansing butter that is used to dissolve a makeup, but you first remove your makeup and then use this one. So in short, absolutely amazing. I'm on my second bottle. Speaking of products that dissolve makeup, this is one of my favorites. This is Wish Rose Cleansing Butter. I have already talked about this product in one of my first videos. It's super gentle, it's super nice, it really dissolves the makeup properly. It's non-comedogenic, it contains green tea extract, melakind and cherry blossom. It didn't clog by pores, it's just an amazing product. The only disadvantage is that it's on the pricey side, I would say. At the moment I use a different cleansing balm, just because I think the product that actually dissolves the makeup, it's not necessary to be that expensive. There are cheaper products out there that do the same job, but honestly this one is really good and if you're willing to splurge on cleansing balms I recommend you this one next I've got few serums these two were left on the side and I finally got the chance to finish them last month let's start with this bioderm serum this is life plankton elixir honestly I love this serum I actually received a sample last summer I tried it it was so lightweight it smells so nice and it was actually working on my problematic skin it says that is mainly anti-aging but for still younger skin like mid 20s late 20s or probably mid 30s it also improves the skin's texture I use that only in the morning this is a quite big bottle it's 50 ml and it lasted me for so long but as I mentioned when I switched to Biology Crochet I gave it a break and I had probably that much left so I decided to finish it I, I didn't want to waste it especially when it's such a good product I gave a very detailed explanation in my very first YouTube video so you can have a look if you are interested but it's really versatile product it's regenerating anti-aging and improving skin texture is suitable for all skin types including oily and sensitive skin the next serum it's like a little jewelry it's super luxurious and super expensive this is 10 ml and it costs more than this big bottle this is dr barbara sturm night serum all dr barbara sturm's products are pricey 
but they're super effective. I've tried their anti-pollution drops, this night serum, her creams, her masks, as I had some samples, and they're really, really good. I would even say they're better than La Mer's products, for me personally. So they're really worth the money as they're really working. I received this little serum in my Cool Beauties Advent Calendar. If you haven't watched that video, I was so shocked and surprised that you have such an expensive product in, in this beauty advent calendar. So this is a night serum. It's, it should be used only in the evening. As at night, our skin regenerates and rejuvenates itself, producing more collagen and growth hormone and less skin-harming cortisol, which is why sleep is a vital part of anti-inflammatory lifestyle. So this serum is designed to boost the nightly renewal process. Honestly, it's a really good product. It did an amazing job. In the morning, my skin was so soft. If I had any redness in the previous night, it was gone by the morning. But to be honest, it's really pricey. The other two serums are my holy grails. They're Biologique Recharge Serum Placenta and Complex Erebiol. I started with their smaller sizes, which are eight mil, and they lasted me for more than a month. But I like that is a glass. I, I always joke that they even look like a little vaccine, but this is a good thing. You pay for the product inside, not for the packaging. Let's start with Complex Cerebio. It's anti-inflammatory and antibacterial. With this serum, you don't treat your whole face, you treat a separate breakout areas. So you can pop it onto the targeted area where you feel your acne is brewing. And if you get the timing right, it might not even pop up. And if you have too oily skin, you can place it on the areas where your skin is producing too much oils. This is my new and favorite spot treatment. I use it morning and evening. I am on a bigger size now, but even if you purchase a small size, as I already mentioned, it lasted me for more than a month as I applied two to three drops. The other holy grail is Serum Placenta. It will repair all the damage the congestion has caused. It contains placental proteins, which are well known for their healing properties. They reconstruct the skin, el eliminating those acne marks whilst still regulating all secretions in the skin. You can also use it around your eyes because it addresses dark circles. Mainly I don't use eye creams in the evening but I apply a few drops from this placenta serum around my eyes and it targets not only dark circles but puffy eyes as well. Absolutely must have. If I need to recommend one Biology Crochet's product this is it and lotion p50 of course speaking of dark circles before i started using this serum placenta around my eyes in the evening i had this little sample from kills advent calendar this is again dark circles diminishing vitamin c eye cream it's a nice hydrating cream but i didn't see anything special and to be honest when i check and when i check the price it's not cheap this cream is not cheap but another really good kills eye cream is this one. This is creamy eye treatment with avocado from Kiehl's. I was dying to try this cream for so long and when I saw it in Kiehl's advent calendar I was like that's it finally. It's a really nice cream but I use it only in the morning. It's super creamy, it's so hydrating, really really good. I would say the texture is a bit too much from the hydrating side. It's actually hard to spread. It is that hydrating and then you get that not not exactly oily feeling but a, let's say glowy look around your eyes which is not a bad thing at all i still love the product i, st I would still purchase it again it lasted me for a few months i'm just using different eye creams at the moment i'm testing new products but i'll definitely get back to this one and the last skin related product will be this acne supplements in my previous and first beauty empties video i shared with you my first impressions i just finished the first bottle and this is the second bottle i don't have anything new to say if you're interested you can check out that video where i'm sharing some more details about this product i really recommend i didn't experience any purging with this i experienced skin purging from different things but not from these supplements. They have a really good ingredients list that will have not only your skin, but your hair, your nails, your general well-being. I recommend them 100%. And now some hair care products, my most favorite ones. I finally finished them. I had like 
two, three washes left in this bottle and I kept using this one as I use it probably once in two weeks. This is a great anti-hair loss range. The shampoo is for dry weekend hair prone to falling due to breakage. They have two versions of this one. This is the matte bottle which is for thick and dense hair and the transparent bottle is for thin hair. The mask is absolutely the best. If you haven't tried anything from that range, I would recommend buy the whole range and see the real difference in your hair, especially if you suffer from hair shading. If I need to choose one product from that range I would definitely choose the mask and the other product that is again hair shading related is this Revelit shampoo I don't know why I always first finish the shampoo and then the conditioner even though I use a generous amount from both products but again a great great product you saw me reviewing Revelit products the shampoo and the conditioner and the hair tonic I have a separate video dedicated for that hair shading using Revolis products. They're the cheaper version. If you're looking for a product that is cheap but still effective, this one is for you. These were my beauty empties for March and April. The feeling is so good when you buy a product and you finish it because you like it, not because you don't want to waste it even though you don't like it. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to support me by clicking the thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and press the bell button for more content from me. See you soon.